and Angel Lucy's funeral home families lined up ready for their annual toy giveaway to children in need. New Center 25 Carolina Astrain spoke with organizers and the children ready to pick out a present to put under the tree. It's a tradition that started nine years ago that still brings smiles to kids' faces each year. And here in Victoria, all of these children will be receiving toys thanks to the generosity from Angel Lucy. Cesar Ornelas, owner of the funeral home, says he's passionate about this project because he didn't experience his first Christmas with presents until he was 13 years old. So I promise if I ever had an opportunity to give back that this is what I would do. And I've kept that promise for the last nine years. Carmen Carapea and Alma Jimenez were in line with family and friends, anxiously awaiting presents. Uh, a guitar. I'm hoping for some headphones. Chris, um, a skateboard. Skateboard and a poppy. But both say they also know the true meaning of Christmas. Uh, the birthday of Jesus. It's about the birth of Jesus and spending time with family. Leah Gordon moved to Victoria from Missouri seven months ago for a new start. Um, I'm still pretty new to Victoria, so I think it's awesome that they have stuff like this to gather people together. Ornelas challenges other businesses to be in the giving spirit. And I would like to challenge other businesses to give back to the community and not just take. The funeral home has other locations, and last Saturday they distributed 6,000 toys in Port Lavaca and 12,000 toys in the Rio Grande Valley. Tonight in Victoria, 6,000 toys were distributed. For more information, visit our website, crossroadstoday.com. In Victoria, I'm Carolina Srein for your hometown news.